Welcome to the Sustainable Energy Forum. I'm your host, Iguma Gabriel. On the program today, we talk about death in the kitchen. The dangers of using the three stone fireplace, a far reaching deforestation, environmental degradation, indoor air pollution, and the list goes on. When the Sustainable Energy Forum went out into the community to find out the dangers of misuse of such energy sources and some of the benefits. The following things you're going to see in the feature are what we found in the field. Wood fuels are largely used for cooking in rural areas, while charcoal provides for the cooking needs of the urban population. Due to this heavy dependence on biomass, 30% of rural areas register a rapid depletion and overuse of forests, leading to a severe lack of biomass for daily cooking needs. Firewood scarcity is a grave constraint in rural Uganda. The traditional use of firewood is responsible for high indoor air pollution levels, thus causing respiratory diseases that affect women and children in particular. Moreover, the two groups spend a lot of time traveling long distances to collect firewood. This deprives women of valuable time to engage in income-generating activities. Children also end up with no time to go to school and study. <laughs> Against a background of high deforestation rates and firewood scarcity in Uganda, different individuals and NGOs have partnered to promote the use of more efficient cook stoves in homes and institutions. Kinechotra <laughs> We serve much because before building these stoves, we were using almost 10 trucks. But now we are using only four trucks. Now there's a very big difference. With all the benefits associated with these cook stoves, why do we have few people still using them? Mm -hmm. 